see. Manual or automatic DSG? Ooh, it depends on the car for me. Nate and I don't always agree. Uh, it, it really depends on the car. For me, if it's sort of in the newer vintage, I'm a DSG guy through and through. I think the DSG is an awesome transmission that gives me the fun of driving a car spirited when I want that. And the ease and comfort of just putting it in drive, or if it's a market, just pooping the nugget uh, and going about my business. I I think that's great. Um, that said, I I love driving the Mark Three GTI with a you know I would hate that with an automatic mm -hmm. Mark Four R Thirty Two manual all day. For me, it just really depends on the car. Yeah, I mean, I'm I'm a accomplished manual transmission driver. I would say I have advanced skills when it comes to manual uh, transmissions. However, um, and, and and like you said, I, it, as a novelty, it, it would be fun to drive a car with a manual sometimes and, and whatever. But on a day to day, or if I'm on track, it's it's really tough to beat uh, either a ZF8 or a DSG. Yep. Just from a performance standpoint, um, the DSGs shift faster. They give greater control. Um, they don't. Uh, unsettle the car so you could literally be mid corner and shift yep. you shouldn't but you can and you know a shift that takes a tenth of a second or less just doesn't upset the car compared to a, a third of a second manual shift with with this kind of big shock load to the drivetrain now if um, you start talking about like a mark sorry mark five owners i promise i'm not just trying <laughs> crap but like the dsg and the mark five wasn't great it really yeah. wasn't I would take a manual, most likely. Yeah, there, nothing compared to the modern. When you modern. get into the newer seven speeds, I I think they're phenomenal. They're tunable. They're smooth when you want them to be. They're spirited when you want them to be. You can get DSG parts if that's your thing. I think uh, you know I talk about this a lot. The, the The biggest problem with the manual transmissions was issues with the clutch, getting the clutch to hold the power. Um, you know, performance. There's performance clutches on the market, but the reliability goes yeah. down substantially. Yep. So uh, with DSGs, you just tune in that clamp load. The transmissions don't have any real issues and they just perform. So yeah, I, I, th I think there was a, a year or two where I was kind of fighting it. Yeah. I just gave in. Just gave it. in. Yeah. That's fair. I mean, look, let me also be clear. If you're a, I'm a manual through and through, that's cool. Oh yeah. yeah that's yeah, super for cool. Sure. If you're a DSG every day, that's cool too. Yeah. I just, I'm, Left uninspired by the newest generation of Volkswagens with a manual transmission. I don't think they shift that well. Yeah, yeah. I drove a new Civic Type R. Amazing. I've if heard they shifted that. like that, I've I'd be heard, manual. I've heard okay. people gush about how nice the manual transmissions themselves. So, so I, I need to drive one of those. 